Let's read the question. At what angle should the two forces 2p and square root 2p act so that the resultant force is p square root of 10? So which you given here, we have first force as twice of p and the second force as square root of 2p. Or resultant force, yani ki r given hai, hume p square root of 10. Or hume find karna hai ki ye dono forces ke beech mein kitna angle hai. To maan lete hai isko theta. So which you have resultant of two forces ke magnitude ko express karte hai square root of f1 square plus f2 square plus twice of f1 multiplied f2 multiplied cos of theta. So values put kar denge. The resultant force is p square root of 10. This is equal to square root of 2p square plus within bracket square root 2p whole square plus within bracket 2 multiplied 2p multiplied square root 2p multiplied by cos theta. Now, when we have two sides ka square, jab hum lenge, to we left mein milega 10p square and right side mein milega 4p square plus 2p square plus 4 square root of 2 p square cos theta. Now, when we have left mein isko transpose kar denge, to we milega 10p square minus 6p square means 4p square. This is equal to 4 square root of 2p square cos theta. So both sides p square p square cancel 4 4 cancel to bachcho hame cos theta equals to mil jayega 1 divided by square root of 2 it means theta ki value aa jayegi 45 degree so correct option is option a thank you